Well, hello everyone. Welcome back to Monster Hunter World on Playframe with a Dan, two Dans, in fact, and two cats and one extra lady who's just sort of decided to hang out with us. Yeah, she's just here. <laughs> Isn't that always the worst when you like go down, you're at a hotel with friends and you go down, you're hanging out in the hot tub and then there's some other random person who isn't within their rights to come hang out in the hot tub as well. They're also a guest, but then it's the vibe is weird. Yeah, like there's a weird other person at the hot tub. There's there's other little hot tub pools around. They could have sit in a different <laughs> one, but you know they chose to sit right next to me. Right. It's like we were having a conversation, yeah. and now it feels awkward. You're just listening in. You're just listening in, and like now I'm nervous and and you know <laughs> doubting everything I should talk about because what if what if you're gleaning information about me? Yeah, or, or at the very like if nothing else, judging silently. Yeah. Oh, that's you know can't, I can't have it. You know what? This. You know what, ma'am, <laughs> you've you've ruined my night. <laughs> Come on over here. <laughs> it's just as well. We do actually have a thing that we have to go and actually beat this time, though. I suppose we could, you know, save the world. Yeah, I guess. Like, no one else is going to do it. Maybe not even us. Yeah, who knows? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe this will just be the series that we just can't beat. Yeah, this is it. Our first loss ever. Right? Incredible. First time Dan and I have ever fought some boss on multiple attempts and uh, had to move on, never succeeding. Yeah. Hasn't happened once. Crazy. Right? We fought so many bosses, too, as you'd think it would have happened. So many. Now. It's really wild, yeah, that it hasn't happened sooner. We're, we're, we're due. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we're due to get completely blocked. <laughs> we're due, we're, yeah, we're due <laughs> to get outskilled. <laughs> And today might be the day. Let's find out. All right. Posting a new quest. I'm going in with a charge blade this time, which is a little less defensive, but judging from that last attempt, that big wave beam thing, uh, which you cannot block through, the Lance is going to have a harder time getting out of the way of that more frequently, I think. So this, this might be a little safer. I don't know. We'll find out. I don't know how you're staying alive with no shield of any kind ever. What is shield? What is that? Like a fruit? You know this big door I've been wearing, like this big car door I've been wearing all the time? Oh, that's They, what they that call is. this a shield. Oh, it's a shield. And if you hold it in front of you, like it stands in between you and teeth. Hmm. Huh. And it works usually pretty good. Well, that's silly. <laughs> <laughs> so what's the point of that? It does seem less fun. In between me? Why would I want something in between? <laughs> Is that engendering my passivity? <laughs> <laughs> well, sometimes the teeth hurt is the thing, and the and oh, the shield the teeth, can yeah, the yeah can buy you a little bit of extra time not being dead, but in fact alive. I suppose. I suppose. Yeah, you. Yeah. I see. I see your point. It's not for everybody, though. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> it's like vitality. It's like yeah. This is not for some people. <laughs> That, nothing nothing made me appreciate leveling vitality more than Elden Ring. <laughs> oh, I bet. Yeah. Over the long run. This is interesting. They've got like a... Is this the same cutscene or are we... No, no, no. Okay. This is the same cutscene. We're just jumping at a different point and in a different look because different gear. Well, if anyone needed the refresher, here we are. Yeah, this is odd that they're doing a cutscene again. Interesting. It is kind of that weird case of like, it was a quest mission that kind of had two stages because first you yeah. fought the Nergigante and then they just jumped you right into the next one but if you decide to go in and do if you fail and you have to go in and do that mission again it shows you the halfway cutscene again it is weird just all the sorts of stuff that Wilds will probably hopefully handle a little bit cleaner where co-op is concerned oh man have you been enjoying those daily weapon videos yeah man they've been putting out a, for everyone else Monster Hunter Wilds the next one coming out sometime next year they've been putting out daily videos showing off the weapons and like some of the new move sets and things like that and boy it's exciting ah oh. oh. looks good looks good it looks so good i can't wait this is something too big for us to take off there's a new like focus mode type thing that all the weapons have for like targeting weak points precisely it's it looks neat There were some of those, like, she can extra features. I think, what was it? Like, the gun lance had, like, the blade tip spun around like a drill. I was like, okay, that's 
that now I want to play that. That seems amazing. <laughs> you're making a good pitch. You're selling me. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I'm just excited to see the cutscene of this massive thing again. And then try to fight it, which will be much harder than watching the cutscene. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Any pro tips as one who has fought and actually beaten this thing on several occasions? Um, so when it's in its rock form here in the beginning, mm -hmm. um, there are a few spots on it that are, are permanently weak. Um, mm. One of them being its belly. Gotcha. Which is risky, but you can just get yellow damage on the belly. That is good to know. Because, yeah, the rest of this, very solid. Yeah. Also, when he when he does the dig, and he's, like, just his little head's poking out with his arms, yeah. um, the back of his head is also yellow damage. Gotcha. Okay. I, there's probably more, but that's usually what I stick to. That's a good place to start. You're our sapphire star. Armor skin. Demon oh, drug. Call, good call. I'm, just, I'm nice and safe up here. I'm going to casually drink my... Oh, yeah. Start your day off right. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going into this fight, and I chug two glasses of milk. Let's go. <laughs> Nothing will go wrong. Oh, boy, it's hot out here. <laughs> <laughs> That hurt. It's so big and chunky and such a nightmare inside. I love the contrast. Right. The fir that that first time you see it is so so good. I did not expect anything. Oh. oh. <laughs> I did not expect anything like that to pop out of this <laughs> little pinata easter egg. What is this? I don't know. Geode? Oh, a ge I like geode. It's a nightmare geode. It's a geode with uh, an eldritch core. <laughs> a very, yes. The eldritch geode. Can you imagine that? Just like cracking open a, a, a geode. And it's like, there's just an eyeball looking back at you. <laughs> it's sounding like something... I've not read Berserk. It sounds like something that would be in Berserk. <laughs> From what you I've know, heard. You know, I've never read Berserk. I, I really should. I should, too. I know it's, like, very M for Mature, very intense, but, like, it is. it has influenced so many things I love. <laughs> yeah. I don't know what this is going to do. Probably bounce, but we'll find out. I don't know. Nice. That worked okay. Okay, back of the head. Yeah. I'm in the zone. It's happening this time. Yeah. Nice. And you're back up. Okay. Oh boy. Meant to do it. Oh, that's right. We didn't have any first aid meds at the start of this one. That's fine. Thank you, Quivers. Woo. Yeah. Quicksand. Right. <laughs> I 
was just charging at him, charging at him. I was like, I'm gonna get it. Why is it getting taller? Oh no. <laughs> yeah, you can get pretty deep in the quicksand, right? <laughs> You're like, oh, is this a problem? My hunters like <laughs> just their heads showing. Should I be alarmed? Come back here. No, come on. Yeah. Is there like even a point of trying to tenderize this thing? Probably. I don't know. I was I was actually thinking about doing the same and I It don't look super tenderized, but I guess it's a little more orange. Okay, alright, now that helps. It's nice and big and slow, so it'll give us... It's very easy to find a window to do it. Mm-hmm. That is... bounce. Oh, you probably shook me off. Oh, because you're doing this. I see. Nope. Ow. Come on, man. That's it. Keep focusing on the head and chest. Thanks, Adler. What would we do without our handler? <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, nice. That was a cool little, like, like sync with different weapons we had there. Yeah, right? <laughs> Almost looked like a coordinated team there. <laughs> oh, you know, it was totally, it was totally, we planned this. <laughs> we practiced hours. Shouted our catchphrase and everything. Ah, oh, what was our catchphrase? <laughs> I forgot. <laughs> Feels like we should have a catchphrase by now. Oh boy. Big hit. Yeah. Oh, oh you bonk I it? didn't get the right spot. I I got him with the uh, uh claw shot thing, the flinch, but I didn't hit the right part of the wall, so it didn't uh. break off. Come on, come on, come on. There we go. Would you keep your belly on the ground, sir? Getting I real can't hit dumpy. If you keep doing that. Stop being covered in rocks. Oh boy. Okay, here. I'm okay. A little shaken up, but I'm okay. Nice. Let's do no. a big hit. Ah. Just caught me with the big stone fingies. Yeah. Maybe caught me too. Maybe. <laughs> it's a mystery. We'll check the tapes. <laughs> Charge up sword. Hit. Get shouted back. 
Like you do. I'm just gonna sharpen up real quick. Don't mind me. That's probably a good idea. Still in white sharpness, but not for long. <laughs> I love it balling up its little wing fists. Sorry. <laughs> that was supposed to be a charge up big hit, not an uppercut. No, they, had part, they knocked me up in there. It was cool. <laughs> Very easy to do that with charge blade. <laughs> I love it. I'm all here for it. Yeah, if you wanna, if you wanna go for a fun airplane ride, I can make that happen. So easily. Which weapon's most prone to that, I wonder? I think... Uh... I want to say longsword just because... Longsword. But I, <laughs> I don't know. I think they just make you flinch, right? They definitely make you flinch. They probably have some swing that throws you up in the air. I think hammer does. Hunting horn. Oh, ha I've, I've definitely had a few hammer friends knock me up. It do happen. I have like one move that can do it and I never use it because it's like Y and B at the same time. And I'm like, yeah, I'm going to do that. Yeah, no, like it's unfortunate. It's like the last hit in my sort of combo in X form, which is inconvenient. Gonna tenderize you up some more. Tired of bouncing off your nonsense. <laughs> Finally dodged that thing. Soften you up. There we go. Okay. Good. Goodness, you're intense. That dang roar. Hold still. <laughs> nice. How did that only hit you once? Nonsense. Now are you still a rock? There we go. Oh, there you go. You said the magic words. <laughs> Good, now you're much scarier. That was just its shell? Man. Right. No, not SOS player, I meant sharpen. Oh, perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Hey, those rocks are nice for hiding behind. Sharp, 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 sharp. There we go. Okay. Nope. Yikes. 
<laughs> Come on. <laughs> Chief. Also, Chief. Whoo, boy. It is a little easier to get out of the way of that, but only just. Yeah, it's a, it's a scary move. Very. Goodness, this thing. Thanks, Whippers. Eeps, no. You keep that away from me. No. I want none of that. Are you sure? <laughs> Alright, maybe just a little. Okay. I knew you couldn't resist. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, you convinced me. Just a small serving, though. Don't want to spoil dinner. Mm -hmm. Oh, no. Mm -hmm. yeah, don't out. want to spoil your appetite. No, 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 no. I did just scarf a seven-course feast in, like, eight seconds back home. But I got, like, a little bit of room left for dessert. <laughs> I can't imagine eating that much and then drinking two entire, like, potion drugs. <laughs> it's like, oh, let me just drink this entire bottle of Pepto. Just ch <laughs> chug the entire thing in one go. Now I'm ready for a fight. <laughs> yeah. Show me to your biggest, meanest monster. Nope. Don't be near that. Whew, I don't know how I managed to get out of that one. It's gonna be a lot of that today. I hate that attack. It's rough. Yep. He... he Double tap me. Oh, cheap. Well, I'll keep it entertained. Okay. Yeah. Did you do that for me? <laughs> for the audience, no guarantees. But this thing will have a good time. Oh boy. Ah, oh, come on. And a one. Don't double tap. Thank you. So here's kind of a random thought. Like, we we have talked before about how this is very similar to boss fights uh, in the Souls games. Mm -hmm. But there is one element, I guess, that is a little bit more challenging, or can be. Like, your average Monster Hunter fight is a good deal longer than your average Souls bo like boss battle. Right. Like, if you've gone more than five minutes in a Souls fight. Something's wrong. Yeah, <laughs> like... It's very likely that something's gonna go wrong and you're gonna have a death happen before then. Yeah. So does that make Monster Hunter bosses harder? I guess you have three lives, which is more than, soul than any Souls gives you. Yeah, I don't know. It's because it's like... There, there's moments where I'm like, I would say like, oh no, it's not hard because like the the monster's not as like like it still kind of feels like an animal. Yeah, where it's it's just kind of like wildly attacking. But sometimes you do have a monster <laughs> that seems like they're they saw the matrix. Yeah, <laughs> they got your number. Yeah, no, like. And you do get breaks. It's not like it's a non-stop. When you get in a Souls arena against a boss, the boss isn't going to, like, run away and give you a moment yeah, to, like, sharpen and collect true. your thoughts. So, like, it's longer, but it's not a constant battle, I guess, unless you're in an arena. But those tend to be faster. Yeah. I don't know.
I guess, there are some, I guess, Monster Hunter fights that are as hard or harder than what you'll run into in Souls. This one seems like one of them, potentially. I've not fought Fatalis, but I can only assume Sam. Oh, yeah, he, yeah, he's a Souls boss, for sure. Nope. He, like, accidentally got in the wrong game. <laughs> got lost in his way to work. You're like, oh, jeez. You hear those casting stories from random, like, Hollywood movies that are, like, <laughs> probably older ones where it's just, like, this guy's sort of wandered in, just, like, just, like, look at them. They're perfect. They're perfect for this. Hey, can you play this extra in the back? <laughs> Not actual Hollywood. Just fiction Hollywood. <laughs> fiction Hollywood, yeah. Yeah. Eek. Don't do that. I'm glad those beams mostly stay in one place. For that attack, at least. Yeah. The one where he goes outwards and shakes them all up is is very rude. Uh, okay, this opposite is a uh, get away from him. Opposite side, yeah. opposite side. Oh, this is not... Opposite side. Whew. Do be cool, though. We're seeing the peepers. We're seeing the peepers now, so we're... Seeing the peepers! So we're making some kind of headway. Get tenderized! Ow. No, you don't. No, uh... Stop looking at me like that. Okay, don't do that attack pointing directly at me. Let me just sharpen. Okay, thank you. <laughs> Ooh. Ow. Oh, Ooh. I thought you did something to it, but no, it was just setting up a big it, ouch I attack. I did get something off to it, but it oh, finished its attack, This is going to be a death. 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 Oh, I I got popped. Oh, and I also did, but Gwibbers is goo saving me. Oh, my gosh. Gwibbers. Yeah, that was pretty rough. Yeah, he, oh. <laughs> he knocked me into the sand, which immediately killed me. Cheap. Oof. This time... As I was trying to heal up the beams. We're going to get it, though. The beams. Okay. I felt better about that attempt than the first one. I'm going to... I'm going to... I think I'm going to throw on some defense here, because... Really? He's a little... He's a little spicy if he... Hits me twice in a row like that. They are spicy hits. Yeah. Is this like... Is this like Rock Lee taking off the weights... Jingle actually like putting defense on. Does this just is this <laughs> super powered mode? Yeah, yeah. It's like oh, now we're fighting fair. <laughs> Finally, a worthy opponent. Yeah, I want a passing glance. <laughs> Warrior blood must truly run in my veins. <laughs> We're beating this thing today. We are absolutely beating this. So let me eat another seven course meal real quick. Problem was I was hungry. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I get that. <laughs> Good to see Every hunter you. knows you need like twenty-five thousand calories a day. <laughs> <laughs> we all know it.
I know there's a happy sweet spot to be found in there, but I do always... There's a little bit of, like, uh, excitement that I get anytime you and I do run into a boss that tests us. That, like, pushes... That takes us a few tries and is not easy. Right? There's a satisfaction in the win once we eventually do get there. I do... I do very much enjoy that. It's wild to me of like how much I've played this game and when I go to upgrade something and it's like, you've never seen these parts. And I'm like, what do you mean I've never seen these parts? <laughs> it is pretty wild how long you can play the game and still not encounter all kinds of end game systems and upgrade materials and things. Just if you haven't done the right end game stuff. Yeah. Okay. We are, we're specced out. All right. We're ready. We're going to crush this guy. This time. Here we go. I'm not even going to use potions. <laughs> <laughs> really That's drive home. That's the trade. You're like, defense? Yes. But no potions. No potions. Yeah. You can't expect me to do potions and defense. So nope. Come on. Be That's reasonable. Cheating. Yeah. How dare I use all the tools presented from the video game? <laughs> you don't think I can do it, video game? Have a little faith. Let's just do a bunch of softening up everywhere. Yeah, that's what I was attaching to. Sure. The wing. <laughs> Maybe attacks to the head and chest are effective? Maybe, Cameron. Yeah. Maybe. I think you're on to something. Could work. Become more orange. Thank you. He looks like a, um, like a DVD cover from a movie from the 2000s. <laughs> Michael Bay's Safajiva. <laughs> yeah. Charge up sword. Oh, that was a chunky. I got a 900. 900? 900. I don't know why I said hundred that weird. <laughs> Forgot the R. Somewhere between hundred and hundo. Uh huh. Nine hundred. I think that's what was happening. I think I was gonna say hundo, and I gave up. <laughs> <laughs> Relatable. Big hit. Okay. Don't really know if impact file does anything against this thing. I don't really know if we can stun it. Probably. The sun was its wing vibrations all along. Was that thunder just now? Like IRL? Wait, did you just hear thunder? I feel like I've heard thunder like three times living here. There's no way. It must have been something outside. It is so rare to hear thunder out here. Like, I... Growing up in the south, like, especially living in Savannah for a bit, like, thunderstorms, tropical storms... Yeah. Annual, like, you... All the time. Living up here long enough, I actually get scared by thunder again because it startles me. It's like, what on earth? <laughs> yeah. You're like, what? What is that? That doesn't happen here. Yeah, I, I, this is one thing I've, I've definitely missed is... is thunder and lightning. There's something nice about it. I don't miss the like power outages or anything, but the uh Oh yeah, that the the downsides of it for sure no. But like the 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 comfort of like the rumble. There's something nice about it. A distant thunderstorm is like there's a really nice vibe about sitting on a porch. Kinda listening to that. Oh yeah. Nice smell of the air, all that stuff. Much more relaxing than any of this. <laughs> I 
What if you run into the wall? What if he did that for us real quick? Ooh, I'd love to see that. Hit it. Oh, what? he was just short. Come on. Damn. I feel like you could have stayed tenderized longer, buddy. Hey. What? No. Wow. It's like he's um raking his little Zen garden. <laughs> well, that's so pleasant. Yeah. I get some, you know, some little bonsai trees and some rocks around. He's trying so hard to maintain a semblance of inner peace, and here we come. Again. And then the angry eyes come out. This monster is basically... Orangutan from Sekiro. <laughs> oh, okay, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Keep raking the garden, carving the Buddha, or else the demon of hatred comes out. Man, the, the first time seeing demon of hatred, you're like, what? Is this in the right game? <laughs> Are you lost? Oof, kind of green sharpness now. Unacceptable. Thank you, I will. I do like its stubby little tail. Yeah. Oh. He was just close enough to interrupt my sharpen, but not enough to do damage. <laughs> mean. Glad that happened. Hey, get launched in a uh, wall. If you... No, don't back up. No. <laughs> He's like, I'll get launched in a wall when I, I feel like it. Do it. Now. Yay. I don't know if it was the right wall, but... Are there particular walls? I I don't know which one you do. I think it's this big point over here. Oh, the ones that have the little points that are hanging a little lower there. Yeah, I think that's for like this uh this like yellow looking rock. Oh, I see. Okay. Maybe next time. Eh, quicksand. Nope, not that big uppercut, come on. Yeah, nice. You're so big and chonky. I do such tiny numbers of damage to you. I think I can see something through the cracks you've made. Don't patronize me. And was like, no, it's totally working. Keep it up. <laughs> You're getting it. <laughs> I, can, I, can, I think I can see some cracks. Ow. Okay, let's uh, let's not die to this first phase. I agree. I second that vote. He, he absolutely just comboed me. I didn't know he had it in him. <laughs> I 
get more orange. Morange. Sorry, had to get out of my system. Good. Back in the fight now. I'm proud of you. <laughs> you have so much armor and HP. He's just very, very chunky. So chunky. I guess it's nice I can get lots of those really big, big charged hits on him. Just he's, he's a big target. He doesn't move around a whole lot, but um, then that changes. Mm-hmm. Don't interrupt me, thank you. Hey, nice. I felt good. <laughs> now there's just something funny about saying the text pop up, but it's like, you can eat again. <laughs> just sort of the, in the middle of this intense fight, after, again, eating two enormous meals and still thinking, what, what was, how did he run that way? <laughs> now you're thinking, I could eat. He, he's cheating. You can eat again. I could go for another bite. Right. Peckish. Let's wrap this up. I could go for another 112 ounce steak. I'm trying to get behind you. You're blocking my view. Get hit. Uh oh. Don't no. Don't grab me. Ow. Green sharpness again. A big damage sponge. It really is. Come on, fall apart. Oh, come on. There we go. Oh, it's that time. Sharpen up time. No, too shaky. Ow. Might as well top off health. Let's not take chances. Thanks, Quivers. I had a similar thought. That was... That was close. It's time it's happening. What hit me? I don't know what's hitting me. Something's hitting me. Is it this big guy? He's definitely hitting me. Nope. Nope, nope, nope. Oh, wait. Tenderize. Get softened up. Thank you. You're gonna hold still, right? No moving? Awesome. Thank you. So uh, coming a mile away. None of that. Yeah.
Charge sword, big swing, okay. Got a rhythm going here. Nope. How did that reach? Disagree. Nope. Ah. There's something especially insulting about missing one of the big swings against something this huge and slow moving. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's like, come on, the fate's gonna align just enough for me. <laughs> the shame. You're definitely not moving this time. Nice. Boy, being under this one feels so much safer than anywhere else. Oops. Forgot that was a thing. Hey, come on. Okay, okay, okay. Let's not combo me, please. Oh, I'm stunned. This is bad. This is bad. This is bad. Yeah, that's pretty rough. Oh. Yep. <sighs> Getting stunned in the dirt. It's so mean. Very, very, very mean. Spiteful. Wow. Get out of the sand. It's dangerous. Oh, that's dangerous too. Ow. Uh, ooh, that may kill me. Oh, Oof, no. It didn't. Hooray. Just stunned is all. I see the stars. <laughs> I, too, am seeing stars. I'm okay. All according to plan. Nope. Thanks, Quivers. That's a good idea. Okay. I'm here. Hooray. Okay, those are coming in. Right? Yes. It's darn sand. Whew, we got lucky. Mostly. Yeah, you're messing with my whole rhythm here. I had a thing going. Oh, there's the runaway. Opposite side, yep. Go, 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 go. Okay. Do a little sharpen. All good. Nice. I will do that also. Ow. I don't know what you're doing, but I don't like it. I'm gonna stay over here. Still. Thank you. Are the eyes out? They're out. Oh, they've been out for a bit. We're making headway. Can you can you not constantly throw me in the sand, man? Stop it with the sand, please. Really got my number. Oh, it's about to have mine too. Work it, work it, work it, work it, work it. Sand, please no. Oh boy, that was scary. <laughs> Closer than I'd have liked. Ow. 
Oof, don't like that. Sorry to anybody who listens to these, usually for, like, the podcast appeal of just us jabbering, because, um, it's not going to happen against this guy. <laughs> yeah, he's still taking a little too much concentration. Just a bit. A little focused. Nice. Nice. Hold still. Get hit. Thank you. That's fine. So long as you let me out. Oh, I uh, don't like that. Oof. Boy, oh boy. I will take these, though. What are you doing? Oh, you're running to a side. All right, where are you going? All the way over there. That's great. Okay. Whew. Good. I was like, if he goes here, I'm toast. <laughs> yeah. I was fearful. All right, energy drink. Come on, I need some stamina. And why not? Just for safety. Vitality mantle. Doing too good to get reckless now. I sometimes forget you have that move. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I think that is thunder. I think it is... You get an actual thunder Some out there. Thunder. Ow. That's wild, because I, I don't even think it's raining. I think we just have a distant thunderstorm. Cool. That or like... Yo! <gasps> Whoa! Hey! I didn't even know we were close. I didn't either. Partner? Holy smokes. I wasn't even hitting that at the moment. I'm just going to assume one of our cats did it. Oh, his eyes are closed, though. Oh, man. <laughs> Goodness, what a thing. Oh, that feels satisfying. Wow, that was great. Good, good hunt. Yeah, good fight. Got a third try. Whew. Yeah, it does feel satisfying feeling like, all right, I figured out how to fight that guy a lot better. I figured out how to dodge. I learned it. Right? Whew. Oh, it is. It is storming. It is storming. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I was like looking at the uh, my my phone for the weather and I was like, oh, it doesn't say it's raining. I just look outside and I'm like, oh, it's raining. <laughs> there is it's storming. Well, if Dan suddenly stops, like drops out of the call entirely and you stop hearing from him for a while, assume thunder. <laughs> And now for a glorious final scene. Oh boy, oh boy. You did it. Thank goodness you're... I... I don't know how you did it. If it wasn't for you, your partner and I would have had to give up our search. Truly, thank you. I'll record everything. This investigation, the old Everworm, all of it. Got your work cut out for you. Ah, that was truly an adventure to remember. I have nothing to regret. But now, now what do I do? A 
great woman once told me, you either push forward or go home. There's no time to second guess yourself. <laughs> You're right. Now that we're done here, I'll have to find a new hobby. <laughs> hey! You kids okay? <laughs> Any injuries? Dude, you were awesome! Good to see you unharmed. Good work. Bravo! <laughs> uh, this thing's huge. My word. To think it was meddling with the Everstream. What are you guys doing here? It was the Commission's decision to leave this assignment to the <laughs> Fifth Fleet. But it was my decision that we ought to go. And that's why we're here. <laughs> <laughs> you got the job done, as expected. <laughs> mm -hmm. All right, time to head back. Yeah. Impossible. Time for round two. That's yeah, still looking just as angry. All right. You want some? Come get some. It's alive? Mess it up, Nergi! Never thought I'd be cheering for you. <laughs> Angry little hedgehog. Oh, don't brag. I softened it up for you a lot. And, well, no, Dan softened it up mostly, and I helped. You're leaving. And I helped. <laughs> Go figure. Just another link in the food chain. What a fight. It's wild to me that the game still hasn't actually, like, revealed what the thing's name is. I'm curious. I, I know they do it at some point. But... Yeah, they prob I imagine there will be a scene where they say, like, let's, here's what we'll call the thing. Mm -hmm. Maybe it's about to happen right now. Yay, credits and a third feast. <laughs> More feasts. More feasts. He's become a fine leader. Seriously? Yeah. Back there when I couldn't handle the pressure, I realized I wasn't ready. Maybe I'll never be. I just don't know. But sir, you were great out there. I agree. If I was in a dangerous spot, it'd be fine if, you know, you lost your cool and went a little nuts. It shows that you care. <laughs> That's right. Oh, reconsider. <sighs> Come on, sir. Settled. What's our next job? Uh, about that. Unbelievable. The Legiana abnormality, Velcana, and the other elder dragons were all linked to the old Everworm. That's all we know. We saw with our own eyes what it did when it rooted itself in the Everstream. But despite our best efforts, I'm afraid we're left with more questions than answers. 
One thing's for sure, it took its sweet time. It crept in quietly, spread its influence, and then... And when things reach a tipping point, the abnormalities start showing up. Wait, if that's the case, won't the ecosystem eventually just destroy itself? No. That's where... Nergi Gante comes in. Uh, hmm. What? Natural purification. Nature. It has unique mechanisms to detect irregularities and balance itself. Mm. Perhaps against such a large irregularity, that balancing mechanism was in fact... <gasps> Nergi Gante! Hmm. Looks like we still have much to learn. <laughs> Perhaps our work is just one part of our balancing mechanism. <laughs> Nature is so cool. Hey, stop talking and start eating. Uh. <laughs> oh, time to party! <clears throat> Cheers. We better get ready for our next assignment. The next one? You know what I'm talking about, sir, Nergigante. We're gonna chase that thing until our legs give out. <laughs> As always, we'll need you. Can't stop now. My work isn't done yet. For helping me discover the story behind this shard, I don't think I can thank you enough. You're really an inspiration. We all look up to you. And we'll need you now more than ever. It's a lot of weight on your shoulders. But remember, I'll be right by your side. Just like in that story, the tale of the five. Whoa, I heard that one. Wherever you heard that? Shot. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> yeah, that was the bright flash of that one, too. Whew. <laughs> now that's settled. Come on, partner. Here's to more adventures. Let's Cheers! 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 <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> and there we are. I, yeah, you know what? I was asking a few episodes ago now, like, uh, what, like, what, what's our wish list for Wilds? And we've talked about a couple of things, like better multiplayer, like co-op main story uh, structure, and just mm -hmm. more monsters, more gear, just more good stuff. I think I would love to see a Monster Hunter game with story worth paying attention to. <laughs> Yeah, because there's not there's not been one, and like it doesn't need it. That's not like I I think Monster Hunter has always kind of known that's not the core appeal of what they're doing, but it could be one of them actually, and I would I would actually love to see that. Yeah, I, I would I'd be I'd be down to see something like their uh, an approach at them trying to tell a interesting story. Yeah, outside of just you know like. Hey, there's monsters. <laughs> yeah, right. It, it does ultimately. It feels very much like the same story over time. Every time, because it kind of is, just with a like a different twist and a different flavor. And it's not like they're not trying, and, and yeah. nor are they not doing like a competent job of just putting a game together and having a little story in there. But it does feel largely like fluff most of the time. That you don't. It doesn't feel like you're missing out on much if you are not paying attention to things. And I, I would, I would love to be. On top of everything else that this game does and that I love, I would love to actually be very invested in the characters and the story even more so. Yeah. That would be... That would be a, a nice thing on top of what the game already is. Right, yeah. Well, like, if, if it doesn't happen, and it probably won't, there's been a lot of Monster Hunter games that it hasn't really happened yet. So if it doesn't happen, that's fine. I'm still, it's still probably going to be one of my favorite games ever. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But imagine. Can you imagine? It'd be so nice. 
So, of course, for those of you who aren't already Monster Hunter players, uh, though we have now hit, like, second credits, like our credits on the, uh, <laughs> credits on the expansion now of Iceborne, that certainly is not the end of Monster Hunter and what Monster Hunter has to throw at you and what you can do. There are lots more monsters now that you'll have access to. Harder ones, meaner ones, cooler ones. Uh, what? There's a whole guiding lands thing that I've never seen before, like a new kind of open world hunting mode that Dan's been telling me is kind of amazing and sounds amazing. That also unlocks after hitting credits on Iceborne. Uh, there's goodness that like there's tons of stuff that they just kept adding post release because they just kept doing that. Uh, there's lots more stuff. This is going to be the finale here. Like we're we're done with Iceborne here now. Finally, four or five years later. But um, I do actually want to see some more of that stuff. So if you want to uh, see some, me like dipping into some of that post game, post credits stuff and the guiding lands, especially, which I'm really like really excited to see. Um, Dan and I are thinking we're going to stream that and we probably will have already streamed that by this point. So if you are wanting to watch that, if you don't already follow me on Twitch, uh, I will link to the VOD in the description and up in the corner right now if you want to watch basically the extended lengthy bonus finale episode epilogue thing <laughs> to this series here if you want to see some more yeah uh that's where that will happen and if you want to watch like we're not going to do wilds uh here on playframe i don't think certainly not a full playthrough but i will definitely be playing that more in streamed form as well so if you Go subscribe to us on Twitch is what I'm saying if you want more Monster Hunter because that's probably where more Monster Hunter will happen in the future. Yeah. Monster Hunter is like such a fun stream game because it's 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 got a nice like here's action, some downtime, you know, can chat, check all your stuff with gear and stuff and you don't have to you know, worry about being on all the time because there's there's nice downtime and it's 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 comfy to stream it yeah it's such a good social game anyway that like it yeah it makes a lot of sense as a uh as a twitch thing i'm looking forward to it Hope you're read too and it'll mean that i can play through it while also kind of keeping up with you and my other friends who play it instead of only being able to record a hunt or two a week and then falling woefully behind and finally getting to end game when everyone else has moved on months ago. <laughs> yeah. You're like, okay, guys, I, I'm on my third hunt. And I'm like, oh, I, I beat that. Are you still on wilds? <laughs> uh, this has been a grand time, though. I'm, I'm glad to have finally gone back and finished it. Thank you, Dan, for helping me to finish it. I really don't know if I would have... <laughs> done this if i didn't have the confidence i'm glad we 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 wrapped it up for you because i i love diceborne so much so it's been so fun revisiting with you it's been so fun yeah i've enjoyed it a lot like i had a grand time doing the first 10 episodes or whatever myself years ago but uh in coming back to it it has just felt all the more clear that like this this is a this is a game meant to be played with friends and recorded with friends as well it's just too fun that way mm-hmm I agree. Come on, Webbers. Let's wrap up with a little... little foot bath. Ooh. Thank you for all the help with the fights, Quibbers. Good job, Quibbers. Yeah, you did good. Hey, good job. Samson, you did great too, bud. Yeah, good work, Samson. I don't know if I've ever seen what Samson looks like <laughs> underneath the I... the mask. <laughs> Before we started the episode, when you could, you could sit in the little pond you can take off their armor i'm like i don't think i've seen you samson not wearing that <laughs> since the start of the game and it was still showing me the armor <laughs> oh that's funny but yeah whoever's your namesake may no longer be with us the catcher named for but i am very happy that we went through the rest of this playthrough and actually wrapped it up thank you for yeah. saving me with the green goo like dozens and dozens of times it really boy that helped <laughs> good cat Good cat. Here, I'm playing the water a bit. Monster Hunter's good. It's good. Uh, thank you all so much for watching, though, and uh, I'll see you next time for something else. I don't know what Dan and I are doing next. We haven't figured that out yet, but... Who knows? Yeah, I know. I I'm excited <laughs> to find out. And Elden Ring is not... It's probably not next, but it's not far off. So uh, please look forward to that as well. We'll see you next time for whatever it is. Bye! Goodbye! Goodbye!